What's up, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel at Javon Salab Products LLC. Hope all is well wherever you at, right? Thanks for tuning in. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, before we start, take the time out to subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification button and hit the share button, right? And share with all your friends on social media, right? And after you watch the full video, hit the like or dislike button. Leave your comments, suggestions, and feedback in the comment section below, right? So today, we're going to be talking about the benefits of being single, right? So this is a personal benefit, right, that I came up with 16, excuse me, with 13, 13 benefits that I've discovered from being single, right? And I want to share it for y'all. I want to share to y'all so hopefully y'all can get some benefit because I know a lot of times people, you know, that single, you know, they may feel, you know, uh, uh, like they neglected or lonely. So I'm here to give y'all that inspiration, right, to let y'all know that it's actually a blessing, right? And sometimes, you know, we don't really see the blessing that we have, right, because it's disguised, and it can be disguised through adversity, right, so I want to share with y'all 13 benefits, right, of being single, right, so let's get into it. The first benefit, what I've discovered with being single, is that you get a peace of mind, right, I mean, you could, I mean, your, your mind is just at peace, right, you don't have to worry about you know, compromising or conforming, right, to your spouse, to your wife, right, you don't have to worry about that, right, because you have a peace of mind, you own your own mind, you have control over your mind, you have a peace of mind, right, the second, the second benefit, right, of being single is that not only you have a peace of mind, you can think, with a clear mind because in order to have a peace of mind you got to be able to think with a clear mind right when you think with a clear mind right when you by yourself and you single you could think with a clear mind because you don't have you know you don't have to worry about you know conforming to somebody else's personality and you don't have to worry about adapting to their personality and to their mood swings and stuff like that right you so you can think with a clear mind and you can make decisions you can make better decisions because your decisions that you make is not affecting your spouse right now it may sound selfish right but these are just some of the benefits that I came up with right now the third benefit of being single, right, is the longer you go without sex, you realize that sex is not an important factor in your life. It's not a necessity, right? We have the basic necessities that we need, like food, right? We need water, right? We need clothes, right? These are things that we need. If a person don't have sex, they not going to die, right? So it becomes a mental, it becomes a mental thing, right? It's all psychological, right? So again, this is a benefit of being single. You realize when the longer you go without sex, you realize that sex is not important, right? You, you become, you become more you know, spiritual as far as if you did decide to approach sex, right? Because you understand that sex is not important. It's not a major, it's not, it's not, it's not a, excuse me, it's not a major fact in your life. So therefore, when you approach it, right, you're going to make sure you want to engage in this type of, in a, you know, intimacy with somebody that has a sound intellect, Right? according to your standards and according to, you know, what you believe, your morals and values and the things that you hold there, right? So the fourth benefit I've discovered with being single is you have more control over your finances, right? 
You know, you got more control over your finances when when you when when you married. You know, you know a lot of times your spouse, you know, they they want to spend money on unnecessary things. You know, they want to go shopping. You know, they want to do this. They want to go out. They want to do this. They they you know. So you have more control over your finances. Right when you have more control over your finances, this plays a major, this has a major impact on your happiness, right? Because a lot of people say money don't make you happy, right? But it can't make you happy. You have to be happy before, but it can sustain your happiness, right? Because you have the freedom to do what you want. You have control over your finances. If you wanted to decide to get up and go travel, right, you can do that on your own. Right. You, 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 if you want to go to a restaurant and sit down by yourself and eat and, and enjoy and enjoy that freedom of choosing whatever you want on the menu, you can eat how long you want. You can just think you can feel free. You go, you go order seconds. If you wanted to do that, right, you can do that. Right. Cause you have control over your finances. The decision that you make is not affected by your finances. Right. Uh, the decisions you make you know, is not affected, the, excuse me, the, the, the decisions you make in regards to your finances, nobody has it, your spouse doesn't has an influence on that, right, because you're single, right, so another benefit I discovered from being single, the fifth benefit, you have the freedom to do what you want, right, because you're not tied down to nobody, right, a lot of times, you know, what I've seen, you know, that a lot of friendships or relationships that you may have with a friend, right? A lot of times these friendships are spoiled because of your spouse, right? Maybe your wife or your husband, they might and they might and like the, the one of your friends or the person you're hanging out with. So this causes a strain on that friendship and maybe you may you may have been friends with that person for years, right? And now you gotta compromise that to make adjustments to her emotions, right, and her feelings, or his feelings, or it could be vice versa, right, depending on if you're a man or woman watching this video, right, so that, that's a benefit, right, also, the sixth benefit I discovered from being single is you can sleep better, right, you can sleep better, you know what I'm saying, you, you got to you could get a better night rest, you don't have to worry about nobody nagging you, right, Somebody, you don't got to worry about nobody, you know, just just kicking you out the night or or, 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 or or complaining about you taking up the covers or the blankets and stuff like that. You just, it's like little stupid stuff, right? You ain't got to worry about that. You could, you could sleep better, right? You can even dream better, right? You have better dreams. You have peace, you know what I'm saying? You just feel that tranquility, that richness of being by yourself, Right and just being and just being so content with that peace that you experience, right? Of getting better sleep, right? The seventh benefit that I've discovered from being single is that you got less stress. Like you really don't have nothing to stress about. What most people stress about is due to a partner that they have, right? Maybe it, it maybe it might be something that's going on with a friend that they have, right? So you when you when you single, you don't have to worry about your spouse friends and you don't have to worry about their emotional swings or how they feel about you and making adjustments to their personalities because they feel offended by certain things that you do or they feel like you taking away from their friendship with your spouse, right? So that's a benefit. Also, what I've discovered, right? The eighth benefit of being single is you can focus more on your goals, right? You can focus more on your goals, right? You can chase your dreams, whatever it is that you desire. Maybe you want to be a lawyer. Maybe you want to be a doctor. Maybe, maybe you want to be an entrepreneur like myself, right? I'm 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 a rebel. I don't I don't like to conform. I don't like taking orders from nobody. That's why I'm an entrepreneur. I'm very stubborn. I'm stuck in my ways, right? <laughs> I'm stuck in my ways. I like to do things on my terms. I want to be the boss. I want to be in control over how much money I pay in taxes. I want my taxes being dictated by employer, so forth and so on, right? 
So you you can focus more on your goals. And when you focus more on your goals, right, this puts you in a position to be in better control over your finances, right? Another benefit I've discovered, right? The ninth benefit is that you have more time for yourself, right? You have more time for yourself. You free. You you on your own term. You ain't got to answer to nobody. That's freedom. That's peace, man. You ain't got to worry about nobody. You just free. You got more free time, right? To focus on the things that's important for you. Like right? the 10th benefit I've discovered from being single is that you can meditate or pray better, right? I know everybody or some people that may watch this video, they might not be, you know, religious, right? But they, but they may meditate. That's still spiritual, right? You know, in my case, I'm a Muslim. I pray five times a day, right? You, you can pray better. You begin to develop a better relationship with in my case, Allah, in your case, whatever it is that you may do, meditate, whatever God you may worship or whatever religion you may follow, right? You will find that you got a better relationship, right, with Allah. It becomes a more, it becomes a more personal, intimate relationship, right? Because you don't have to worry about the unnecessary mental agony, that having a spouse can have, you know, during a time, like, for example, when I, when I was growing up, my, my grandmother and my grandfather, they was together for, for 52 years. Like I, I, I've seen my, my grandfather and when he was alive, I've seen my grandfather and my grandmother communicate, you know what I'm saying? And I, I seen them go through trials and tribulations, but I seen love. Overall, it was love. You understand what I'm saying? It was true love back then. When my grandparents was growing up, it was true love. Right? Like now, with everything that's going on with technology and everything that's mo mo and everything moving so fast and people are influenced by social media and, and so much people, you know, in their ear. You know how much marriages broke up because of social media? You know how much marriages broke up because of social media, but because of listening to friends that's maybe single and miserable. Y'all know what I'm talking about, right? Y'all know what I'm talking about watching this video, right? So that's a benefit. You could pray and meditate better, right? And for me, if 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 it take for me to be single, to have a better relationship with Allah, I'll be single. That's that's just me. That's that's first and foremost before anything. My relationship with Allah come before any relationship. Business that I mean anything. My relationship with my with my with my, with my parents, the foundation of all my relationships is built on my relationship with Allah, right? Now, also, you could take better control over your health. Because when you're single, you can exercise better. You can exercise when you want. You don't have to make adjustments to your spouse, you know, or her complaining or or him complaining that you 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 eat into it, you eating this or you ain't eating this. Why you always exercising? You don't spend time with me and this, that, and the third, right? So you got better control over your health, right? You can focus on your diet better and. More so, because you got better control over your health, your mind, you can think more clear. And this is health, right? The thoughts that you have, right? That's health. That has a major impact on your health, right? The thoughts that you have, right? You get more spiritually connected to your beliefs. Again, in my case, I'm Muslim. So, I find... By just these last year, couple years of me being by myself, yo, I realized so much things that I never realized when I was married. Yo, I realized so much. I've 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 received so much spiritual wealth in these last couple of years since I've been single that yo, 
I'm, I'm just so thankful, man. The things that I'm thanking the law for now, I was not thanking the law for when I was married. Honestly. That's, that's, that's the truth, right? So that's the 12th benefit. You get more spiritually connected, right? The 11th benefit, the 11th benefit, excuse me, I missed that one, is you, you, uh, you have better control over your health. Sorry about that. And then... Also, you have better intuition, right? Aside from praying better and being spiritually connected, right? You have better intuition, right? Your decisions is more grounded on logic than it is on emotion, right? That's the benefit of being single, right? You got more foresight. You got better foresight. You got a better insight. You follow your gut more, right? And then lastly, the 13th benefit is you got a better imagination. And in this case, Albert Einstein, Albert Einstein, he said that imagination is better than knowledge, right? But that was just his philosophy and what he believed. But in my case, right? With your imagination, you need to have an imagination, you know, in order to be an entrepreneur, right? Because you got to be a visionary. You got to be able to see 10, 20, 30 years down the line, right? And in order to function on this level mentally, you got to be stress-free and you got to have a clear mind. and You got to be goal-oriented. You got to know what you want because when you know what you want, you would know everything that you don't want in life. You would know if this person or these people is going to take you away or distract you from your goals that you're trying to achieve, right? So that's 13 benefits that I came up with at Jerron Salah Products LLC, right? Hope y'all enjoyed the video. I love y'all. Stay blessed. Stay tuned for future videos. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, Jerron Salah Products LLC.